with uh, Ryan Leonard of the Cochran Crunch uh, and uh, Shane Battler of Cochran. Uh, Ryan, can you comment on tonight's 3-0 uh, loss? Uh, you know, 3-0 loss, an empty netter, so really 2-0 at the end of the day. Then really 1-0, their first goal was goalie interference. Our goalie had the puck, the guy drove the guy in the net and the referee allowed it. Uh, you know, at the end of the day, I thought our players worked hard today. And I thought we were cheated here in our Dudley Hewitt Cup game today, big time. Our goalie was ran three times in the second period, not one call. And we battled a lot here. We had a guy high stick in the face, blood everywhere. There wasn't going to be a call. How do you win hockey games like that when you're not getting any calls in a rink like this, when we're battling and battling? I thought we were working them at times. Uh, we were, it's probably one of the harder games we played this year. We played hard. We were finishing our hits. And uh, I just think that we really ripped off today at, at an event like this. And coming from, again, you have a goal, Shane sitting beside you who was in the net. Can you comment on tonight's game, Shane? Uh, I think it, it is what it is, and we just have to come strong tomorrow and bring our best game forward and hopefully get the win tomorrow and go from there. And like I say, with the win tomorrow, like you say, there's still a chance that you can't be playing Friday night with the, with the win tomorrow, right? Tomorrow we got to come here, beat the OJHL tomorrow, which will be a tough task, but like today we played one heck of a hockey game. We were skating hard, uh, we were playing hard, we were getting lots of shots. Uh, their goalie again saved them in the game like he did last night. And uh, th that was the difference today. But uh, we got to come hard tomorrow against the OJ and get a win there, and then hope the Thunder Bay beats Dryden tomorrow night, and that puts us in. So. And Ryan, like you say, it seemed a little bit, even though the outcome of the game, a little bit more positive from last night. But what do you guys have to do tomorrow to get that? Don't change a thing. We, we, I thought we played really hard tonight. Uh, our compete level was great. We moved the puck nice. We were finishing our hits properly. We were playing great defensively. And uh, just hopefully we start getting some bounces. And Shane, as a goalie, like you say, does your performance, not depend, but does your performance reflect on how the guys are working in front of you? Uh, not necessarily. I think a goalie gets to steal a game here or there. Um, it just really comes down to how you prepare and when you when you show up to the rink and make sure you're ready to go and how you carry yourself off the ice. And Ryan, like I say, I mean, sorry, Shane, as, as a 20-year-old, what's it like to be playing, like I say, at a Central Region Championship? Uh, it means everything. It's a great experience. Uh, it's really exciting. Uh, having fun here. And, uh, yeah, it was just a great experience. Well, thank you very much, and good luck tomorrow night, guys. Thanks, Thomas, Jay. Thank, thank you. you.